Are you anxious about your financial state? Many believing Christians live as if they are orphans or that they have an irresponsible father. Yet they are living purely out of ignorance or disobedience. If men know how to give good gifts to their children how much more God your father. It's time to seek the Lord and find him. This post emphasizes that you should not be anxious about anything as a child of the Almighty God. Therefore do not worry, saying, what shall we eat, or, what shall we drink, or, what shall we wear? For your heavenly Father knows that you need all these things. But seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added to you. Therefore do not worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will worry about its own things. Sufficient for the day is its own trouble, Matthew chapter 6 verses 31 to 34, NKJV. Many Christians toil all day and night and start all over the next day only to still subject themselves to anxiety. Should they sit and ask themselves questions and seek answers in line with God's word, they will discover that they have only wasted their energy and time by worrying and in the process displeased their heavenly Father, Hebrews chapter 11 verse 6. Now, this is not that you are not to work or think towards solving a challenge but that you should not be anxious about anything. Your Father in heaven is a loving and responsible Father. He knows your needs and is more than capable to provide all your needs. If He gave His only Son for you, how will He not with Christ freely give you all things? Romans chapter 8 verse 32. All He asks of you is that you should believe in Him as your Father and seek first His kingdom, Matthew chapter 6 verse 33. Having anxiety shows that you don't trust Him to play His role as your Father. Which child whose father is with him worries over school fees, what to eat, drink or wear? Children don't concern themselves with such things. Their fathers don't expect them to do so either, rather they will be interested in them obeying them and doing well in school. So why should you as a child of the Almighty God be worried over what is not your responsibility? Focus on doing your father's will and let him focus on taking care of you, including what you eat, drink and wear. Whatever you desire according to God's will, ask the Lord for it and like a child believe that it is done, that your Father will surely do even as you have asked 1 John chapter 5 verses 14 to 15. The psalmist said that he has never seen children of God begging bread, Psalm chapter 37 verse 25, paraphrased. If you are willing and obedient to your Father, you will eat the good of the land, Isaiah chapter 1 verse 19, spend your days in prosperity and your years in pleasure, Job chapter 36 verse 11. In conclusion, you are not to be anxious for anything, for your heavenly Father knows that you have need of those things, rather choose to obey and serve Him today and let Him do His own part as your Father.